Plutonium. With the shutdown and radiation cleanup efforts at the crippled Fukushima nuclear plant expected to last months, if not years, experts are wondering how the disaster will affect the growth of the multi-billion dollar nuclear power industry around the world. Even the most optimistic analysts forecast a serious slowdown. Adrian Hamer is executive director of strategic programs at the U.S. Nuclear Energy Institute. After the incidents in Japan, uh, nuclear energy is going to continue to move forward, okay? It won't move forward in the same pace uh, in the next uh, two or three years. In the United States, not a single nuclear power plant has been built in 32 years, not since the Three Mile Island nuclear plant accident in Pennsylvania in 1979. Public fears of the environmental and public health risk of radioactivity leaks and the rapid development of other clean, renewable sources of energy have kept nuclear energy development in a box. And Fukushima, some experts say, could turn that box into a coffin. Chris Flavin is the president of the World Watch Institute, an environmental watchdog group in Washington. This could well be the end of nuclear expansion uh, worldwide. Uh, it, the industry was already on a very narrow field of opportunity because of the huge costs and the, the significant public opposition in many countries. But nuclear power advocates say mishaps have been rare. And they note that amid growing concerns over climate change, air pollution, and the need for cleaner, carbon-free energy, nuclear power is already playing a vital role. Charles Ebinger is the Director of Energy Security Initiative at the Brookings Institute in Washington. Nuclear power currently accounts for about 14 percent of all global electricity. And the simple reality is if we were to forego further nuclear development uh, in the near term that would place a great uh, burden on additional fossil fuel utilization. One small pellet in the reactor fuel uh, is equivalent to one ton of coal and there are normally between 80 and 100 railroad cars full of coal that are burnt in a power plant each day. Construction of a modern-day nuclear power complex can run into the billions of dollars and owners can spend years waiting for final operational approval. That has prompted many countries to question whether they want to approve any nuclear plants, new or old. Soon after the accident at Fukushima, many countries reacted. Charles Ebinger explains. Germany initially say they were going to uh, uh, close down seven plants and do safety reviews. Uh, they've now gone further and are calling into question uh, the future of nuclear power, new plants in Germany altogether. Countries like China and India, both facing the problems of air pollution and climate change, are investing heavily in non-fossil fuel energy like solar, wind and especially nuclear power. In China, which is the leading the nuclear renaissance with about 23 reactors under construction, and plans for 60 or 70 more in the near future uh, announced too that they were temporarily uh, uh, slowing down to review their safety procedures. When we write the final history of, of does Fukushima actually become the sort of final chapter of the global nuclear industry, what happens in China will probably be the thing that determines how that story comes out. In the United States, the accident at the Three Mile Island nuclear plant cast a long shadow over the industry. The federal government's Nuclear Regulatory Commission, or NRC, has been in no hurry to grant new operating licenses. There's only one reactor under construction in the United States, despite passage nearly six years ago of uh, legislation that gives loan guarantees to the next four plants. There are now there are 20 plants in the pipeline before the NRC, but they're moving very slowly and, and their supporters aren't exactly pushing uh, hard. In the meantime, people still need electricity and lots of it. According to the International Energy Agency, between now and the year 2050, the global demand for energy will triple, requiring an investment of about $350 trillion in energy infrastructure. How much of a role, if any, nuclear power will play is a question whose answer may lie in the smoldering ruins of the Fukushima reactors. This is Sulima Palacio, VOA News.